Hey y'all, this is Ursh, and welcome back to XCOM 2, the true hangover. We're hanging out here with Baby Shen, because we're about to get ourselves a combat knife. Anything else we want to build? Nah. Just a combat knife. Give me that. Alright, solid. Now I want supplies left. That's okay, because we're going to go out into the world here. Hey, I do want supplies, but not now. What we want to do is try to start making contact here. 31 hours for intel, though. I'm going to start building this so I can get down to this whole space. We make some good progress there, but let me grab the intel while we still can. And then we're going to start making more contacts and more monies. There's no way we're going to make more contact before our supply drop is in three days. Yeah, there's no way. The outcome of this ah, new research. Can only further okay, what do we get from this? Command. Defense matrix, okay. Seem to have any issues stationing Not the AGL. Weapons in close proximity to the people in those cities. Really shows you how much they care. Oh, they care so much, so very, very much. Uh, encryption. Yeah, I'm, I guess I'm not really a fan of psionics right now. I don't need it. Um, let's get the mimic beacons, I guess. I am at a loss for words to describe the difficulties we have had in attempting to handle this creature, affectionately known as the Faceless. To our troops, the Goo Man, the nebulous form of its God, it's physical freaky. structure, including a pliable, semi-solid outer layer, seems to be slowly degrading now that the creature has expired. There is also a pungent odor that only seems to grow stronger as time passes. God, it's such a creepy, like goo walrus. Ah, oh, it's like a horrifying thing. They really did a good job with that. They really did a good job with that. Anyway. Intel, one hour. Hey. Strategic resource located. Okay, I'll take the 47. And now, friends, we're going to go and start making this here so we can make contact with East Asia. What is the Asian bonus anyway? Oh, spare parts. Right, right, right. Uh, program ground. That's pretty good. But we're going to try to go down here to New Indonesia and hit another facility before this after our project really kicks up. So we're going to need to always hit a facility and then probably deal with a retail relatively soon. Let's make this thing here happen. The most efficient way to do this. I mean, do you connect to anything else? Now, you do connect to West Asia, so it is, doesn't make sense to get. No, you don't connect to West Asia. Oh, Asia's gonna be really intel expensive. Look at this crap. Because this does not connect anywhere here. Oh, so we can't really get any nice central towers up. Alright, well, whatever. Build this one then. Yep. Setting course for sector one. We'll start installing the relay. Then we'll try to make contact here. It'll save us some intel at least, but 160 intel is not cheap for uh, region connections. Priority message oh, what? Really? Oh, no, there we go. It on screen now. Your progress Don't like you. Over the past month has been significant, Commander. Yes. But there is still room to you can go suck it. We are going to eliminate the Major Indian breakthrough, threat. we need to stop. Oh, God. That is awful. That is awful. Awful. So both of these are imminent. Which means I should hit the supplies while I can. Okay. We're gonna about to hit a retail and a facility, and they're gonna get a breakthrough. We're tighten the they're tightening the noose pretty hard. I mean we we're still okay. We have two things we can kick the facility counter down on. Maybe the facility will be somewhere I can actually get to it this time, maybe, who knows? Commander, we've located Where? one of their facilities. No, of course not. Yup. Whoa, nine days? Excuse me? Okay, that changed things. Nowhere near as much time as I thought I had. Alright, we're gonna hit a facility then. I am sure you will find what we got? To be that is crazy. That went uh, really fast. I've often wondered how the aliens could conceive of such a being. Is there another world out there filled with these shape-shifting creatures? God, I hope not. Or are they merely another construct of alien genetic tampering? <laughs> Mimic beacon, alright. We do end encryption to start getting the kind of game stuff moving a little further. Let's do that. I foresee a number of valuable applications. Okay, so obviously we got issues. I'll have a report um, we need to stop this thing. We only have that much time, honestly, to do it. All right, done. Ignore. We're gonna go hit a facility now, because uh, that's what we need to do apparently, and we are really running out of time. Seven days, twenty hours. We gotta make some more time up. Okay, so we're almost out of fatigue for everyone, so we're gonna go ahead and take the A-team to hit... Should we do the forge? I say we do the forge. Uh, I mean the... What the hell this is? Black site. We do the black site. Launch the black site. It's hunter after supplies too, which is nice. Western United States. And what are we doing in the... 
Wait, do we have muter on grenades soon? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Do we have muter grenades? Plasma grenades in one day. Oh, I really should have that before we hit this. I'm afraid without plasma grenades is going to be really hard. Let's put some time into the truck then. Avenger I just want to get the grenades. And this course. is coming to get really close. We're going to have to deal with the retaliation as well. Oh boy. Alright, it's alright. Okay, we're not we're not losing the game yet. About to though. There's retaliation. Foolish hero. Okay, never mind. We're gonna do that first then. Then we'll get the muton grenades and we'll go hit the facility to stop the end game from happening. But seven days, didn't give me a lot of time on that one. Manny's just pissed I'm probably riding the wave a little too much. Now we're gonna take an A-team on this because these missions are hard. As remembered last time, we got in a massive fight that we really didn't want to play with. And let me go quickly to here. Get Calvin out of here. You and out of here. Jackson Blades out of here. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Then we run in back here so we know how we staff it. Alright. Retail. Confirm. Okay. So now we're going to get some fun up in here. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Let's get everyone loaded out, and then we'll load everyone back in. Stupro, Lady Pie, Spike, yep. Uh, Mad Dog, Arkbird, Cochran, you're still higher rank than T Bone. You are no longer higher rank than T Bone. Same HP. You've got way more will, though, and just a little bit worse aim. Let's get you in there. Because if we get sec toys, it's going to be a liability. Uh, samurai. Because we need that. And now we got... So Necromancer, Grenadier, Ranger, Spec Ops, Assault, Specialist. And maybe a Gunner? This is not the kind of mission for... Sit back and hold tight stuff, but... Uh, or we can take a Sharpshooter. And she does have a promotion handy. So either we take a gunner or a sharpshooter. I'm feeling sharpshooter more than anything else. And I'm probably going to go ahead and take uh, quick draw. It makes her more useful when she can't get that high ground, you know? Or if we can maybe grapple the high ground, we can still get, you know, two shots over that in lightning hands without having to use... I just promoted you. Yeah, I just promoted you. Good job. Okay. So we got to kick some... Kit some people out here uh, as we tend to. Make weapons available, yup. Alright, no messing around. Sunfish, you're getting... Uh, I mean, Sunder Vest, yep, Rooster. That's fine. Gonna get you... Blue screens, we're gonna hit some nasty stuff, I think. Frag grenade. T-shirt. Uh, we could, might be able to get a second medkit out of here. Might be able to field more medkits. Which is not a bad plan, all, t all told. Uh, stay there for now. Let's do the obvious stuff first. Where's our spec ops? There's Spike. So, man, you're not running a sniper rifle, dude. You're running this. You're not made for sniper rifle duty. So, what is this? this is two to four. Hmm. So, that's not great. I may keep the axe, actually. That doesn't seem like it's doing much for me. Yeah, let's take the Viber Blade. That way we need to go loud, we'll have more flexibility on what to do. I'm a little peeved that I don't have mutant gr mutant muton <laughs> mutant grenades. We don't have muton grenades for this. But alright. That's fine. We already know the smag does work there. Do the obvious stuff here. Spark plug. Uh the burn. Yes, do that. Frag. T-shirt. Let's go with actually maybe. Because you don't have combustion. Incendiary might be a good option for you. That's fine for now. Ammo? No, we're going to use that on a frontliner. Did we not give a decent armor to Spike? We did not. Demon. This was useful last time. I think it's going to be useful again. Let's do it like that. Yep. Alright, Smag, Ace. Alright, let's get this loadout done. Let's get the Defenestrator. Let's get... Now we're going to use that for our Samurai. This is going to be better. Queen B, because obviously. Knuckles, no. Ah, okay. No, we're not going to do it like this. Uh, go here. 
We are going to give Spike the... Spike, yeah, Spike, the other combat knife because we have two more melee wielders here. We're going to switch out the weapons like that. Get me the Hunter's Axe, Defenestrator Queen Bee, T-shirt, and I'm probably going to give you the Medi Kit because you tend to get yourself a little beat up. I'm going to give you Talons. Okay, good. Then we're going to get... Let me get our Samurai out because this kit is relatively obvious. Load out. Uh, let's go... Hmm, were you the guy who was running all purdy like yeah, you got mobility already wait do we not have a spec on this hold on I don't have a spec on this mission no we do have a spec okay it's fine and you're not really made for gunning as it is we'll give you stocky we'll give you mobility there we go spitfire we'll give you the knuckles which gives you the armor when we need it that works that works. That works. Okay. Solid. As my dogs go ballistic outside. Marvelous. I'm going to have to deal with that. Give me two seconds. Okay. Handled. Uh, let's see. Good. So we're we putting the med kit on. I still feel like Arkbird would be the best target for it. Uh, let's go with the Gremlin, the Calamity. Make sure we get that working. Stocky 2. She's good at that. Nero, are you frontline enough for that? Are you frontline enough? I think so. Yeah, I think she's frontline enough for that. Load out. Yup. Give you the t shirt. Give you a medi kit. What? Do we just put the med kit down somewhere? Oh god, I'm getting. Losing my mind here. Losing my mind. Put it on you? No. And that's right, put in our assault. Duh. Yeah, yeah, right? Put it here. Yep. I got re I'm really pissed that something went wonky and we got these bizarre, like, uh, armor colors. Like, it just doesn't look good anymore. It used to look cool, and now it's. Now it's lame. I don't like it anymore. Alright. Fair enough. This is our crew. This is how we gonna play it. I'm gonna break some stuff. This gun is so cool looking. I gotta say, man, this gun looks so cool. Do we have any, like, really good additional mods on weaponry? It feels like we've been getting a lot of drops. None of it has served to really fix this. Uh, let's just see. Loader and repeater. That's not... None of that's great. I might be able to tweak the AGL, actually. Hold on. That might be a thing. Can we tweak the AGL? Corrosive shrapnel. Increase like shredding. That's saving us right now. Advanced liquid explosives. <sighs> uh, AGL apparently does not have any other ability here, so no, it's not going to help us at all. Your predator armor. You don't have anything. A tactical sensor. Yeah, let's do a tactical sensor. I like it. Tax sense. Good. All right. There you go. See, now you have an armor. It's white quality. It's not uncommon, but it's all right. Advanced focus and focus. I don't care. All right. What about you? Do you have a focus PCS? You don't. Because you're not exactly... you got pretty high will. So I don't get MC'd or something weird. Let's put a PCS on you. I mean, I'm not going to be able to do this. This is worth some money, I guess. We could sell them. Let's sell them. I just can't find a good use for them, honestly. Alright, stocky. Everything's loaded out. Everything's set up. Let's defenestrate some fools and save the day once again. Make sure we have throwing knives. We do not. See, that's what I thought happened. And we don't have the frostbite. Right? God! I'm like half not functioning today. Let's get... Uh, who would be a good frost wielder? I think it may be the samurai. Because he's going to be really in the thick of it. Oh, you can only get one grenade. Someone who's going to be close enough to make it work. I'm feeling like Arkbird's again the target here. She's got decent mobility for what she's doing. Yeah, all right. I'll make you utility. I'm a gas grenade, too. Might be good to get this on Cochrane. All right, Cochrane, get the gas grenade. Okay, good. All right. I think we're set. Let's rock and roll. Now we're good. I'm hopeful. I haven't really had much use for the bolt caster this game so far. I just really haven't. 
I'm not sure if that's my own deficiency or not, but that one that one round is really the issue. That single solitary round is always the issue. Ready to drop. Operation Foolish Hero. Oh god, don't name it like that. Oh, that's terrible. Why you gotta go and name it like that? <laughs> Foolish Hero, huh? Alright, alright, alright. All right, all right. We'll play. We'll play along for now. But only for now. Press any key to launch. Alright, let's go. Whee! All right, here we go. Again. Minus one five. Hostile forces are attacking the outpost. Eliminate all enemy units and protect those civilians. Advent came in hot, and so did we. You won't have a concealed position for deployment on this one. Except Spike always does. Don't worry, buddy. Spike. There you go. All right. Sam Fisher. Where are we? We are on the corner. Yeah, more or less the corner. So enemies are going to come in from this general area. Where are there civilians? Do I see any civvies yet? No civvies near me. That's not a good sign. That means they're near the aliens, and that's bad. Any civvies? Oh, come on now. That's really not good, actually. That's really not good. Can we get some idea of where the A's may be? All right. No visuals at all on anything here? Jeez, alright. Well, we're gonna boogie then. Uh, no, I need my summon eye. Where are you? There you go. Doc, get the doc. Exactly. That's exactly what I was thinking. Man knows my heart. Alright, Arkbird is probably gonna be giving us blue move overwatch. Honestly, Cochran's the other guy's gonna need to run Cover as fast as he can. Alright, I'm not keen on this already, since it's relatively clear to me that we're going to be doing some serious running. Who the hell is Patrick Jones? Newbie? Alright, we got one newbie. Ah, congrats, dude. I don't know if, what you really want to be doing here, but... And Wild Child. Okay. Hey there. Welcome. So we got two newbies here. Let's see what happens. Patrick and Wildchild. See what we got. I'm going. Get Overwatches around. Fire yep, just Overwatch. Overwatch. On Overwatch. Come get some. All right, and there we go. Mutons, Berserker. Some dudes. Commander, the situation just got worse. Resistance outposts are reporting enemy transports on the move across this region. Oh dearie Getting me. For an all -out assault. It's it's a siege mission. I didn't even click in my head that that's what it was. Oh man. Okay, cool. So we can unload. Wait, really? We don't see the mutants from here? Can't grapple. Oh dear. Didn't even realize it was one of those. Okay. And Spike's the only one who sees them. Fascinating. Alright, siege mission then. Okay, that's a little better. Because, alright, <laughs> that's why there's no damn civilians on the map. That explains so much. I do need to shred some armor off of these punks, but they're gonna go... go nuts on me as soon as I get closer. Let's see, can I do... They're gonna keep rolling around this way. We're gonna have an Overwatch trap par excellence. Don't wanna waste that opportunity. I will be able to get a shot there, though. I think. Yeah. Can we get incendiary? We can get two of them. They're better than nothing. And we can set fire to the entire space that they run through it. Screw it. Let's activate early. Because if we start getting reinforcements up, it's going to get ugly. Inevitably. Indibidi bibidi boo. The armor shredded. Now, the other two aren't shredded, but that's okay. Hi there, Zorker. This is three mutons and a Zerker, I think, is what we're looking at. Yeah, three mutons and a Zerker. Aww, they didn't all burn. That didn't work out anywhere nearly as well as I'd hoped. 
<laughs> oh man, okay. That's actually really unfortunate. We have limited vision on this stuff. I'm not too happy about that. I'm trying to burn the rest of you. 9 to 11. Can we do... How about that? Okay, smaller AoE on lightning. Oh no, lightning. I need vision. Oh, I see. Lightning is a little less flexible with targeting. I'm like, I remember the lightning AoE being pretty big. We can't actually do what we want to do here. We need to get behind cover anyway, so it makes sense that Zen is going to need... What are you flanked by, though? Oh, everything, because you're not behind cover. <laughs> right. Okay. I was going to poison something else, too, but that's not going to happen. I'm going to fireball something for fun. So who's currently on fire? Is it you that's shredded? Yeah, you're, you're on fire. Oh, come on. I had a fireball up here. Don't give me that googly moogly. All right, we're going to move anyway, so this might give us a better angle on the fireball as well. So Zen, get over here. Yep. Get fireball up in her. Yes! Yes, that's what I'm talking about, friends. This here would be the diction that I'm trying to aim for. No, can we get just a little bit more? No, we have to go for these two. And I'm alright with that. Hey, what's up? You'll be rendered to cinders, indeed. Indeed, friends. Indeed. Fireball's one of those good abilities you love to have with you. Hey, Sniper. Do you have basic shots on stuff? Because you got lightning hands, you got some... You can do some serious damage. Let's see. 3 to 3, 85, 68, 27, and dick all. Okay. What about your shots? 71. Really? Okay, that's really unfortunate. Wild Child has some aim, but not much. Jones. Spike's got some flexibility on the action here. Do you have a flank, maybe? Got a flank on that muton in there, which is nice. Can we get a flank on this muton up here? Looks harder than anticipated. Uh, I don't like that very much. If we can handle this first pack easily, then we're in good shape. What's up? All right, well, look, the sunfish work for us here. Make it work for daddy. Hey, damage good. Good shot. Just gonna keep unloading the rounds, because this is when it's gonna be all tasty. Oh, damn, missed. Okay. Makes a 72. Alright, we got 78 with a stock. And we got some... Still got some issues here in the mutons. I can't melee these guys. We're gonna get... Oh, wait a minute. We can't be dodged on melee, can we? Yep. We can flesh mutons. We can freaking flesh mutons, baby. Can we do this from a way that we're not going to trigger something? Because this looks like it's pretty solid on the cover side. Okay. So we can flesh mutons. We've got to be a little careful, but that is always an option that we have. Good. Right, Wild Child, can you shoot the Berserker from here? You can. We need to deal with that muton with the 8 HP there, though. He's not on fire, and it's not really going to be conducive to a long and healthy existence. I've still got basic ballistics. We haven't sprung for the upgrades. It's okay. Where's Pat? Hey, Pat. Can you shoot something? Shoot a Zerker? Have you shot your local right, Zerker today? I think you have. You look like a man who has. Yep, shoot the Zerker. Angry Zerker's angry. Good shooting. All right, Mad Dog. Um, it's a matter of optimizing what we're doing here. That Muton is probably going to burn to death. That one probably won't, so I would need a little extra damage on him if possible. Not looking likely at this stage, though. So I may want to get Arkbird up with the... stock and do something about that. Is that you, Arkbird? That's no, Cochran. Arkbird, can you get up on that stock and hit that other Muton? Yeah, you can. So I'm pretty sure that guy is going to go burn. Yeah, I want to hit that guy with 4 HP. Can you get it from here, maybe? Yeah, we can pop that there. That's fine. Yep, Heading go there. Out. Heading out. Okay, good. Don't care about that guy so much, like I said. Care about... 
Uh, I do care about that guy, but that guy. This is gonna be pretty much... Oh, wait, no. Stock, right, and armor means I'm not gonna do two. I'm gonna do one. Alright. So not the best plan. Oh, God. Alright. So we still got some some serious damage to do here. And primarily, I'm worried about this damn Zerker. I, mean, I might as well take the lightning hands here to whittle this thing down. So I want to make sure I can shoot my sniper rifle afterwards. The aim on the pistol is not exactly stellar. Alright, let's try to get rid of the Zerker then. Pinged him. Didn't need it, actually. Alright, well... Wasted that, unfortunately. Mad dog. Yeah, this is... That guy's in a really annoying spot. I don't want to waste my really valuable tools here. Spike, what do you got, man? That's not going to help me right now, dude. Where is the cover that this guy is sitting in? There's so much smoke here, I don't know where... Where's his cover from? It's here, isn't it? That's his cover. Can we get out here to a flank in this guy? I think we can, actually. I think we can. And how much damage do we do? We run the risk of not killing him. But if we stock him, then we kill him. The problem is that other Muton's probably gonna run up Roger on us. That. We can go a little risky here. Yep. Oh, okay. Get another pack, get another pack, get another pack. Okay, wow, another big, big, big pack. Hey! They didn't activate. But that's dangerous. That's very dangerous. There's a pack there. The odds that there's a pack here. That's probably going to activate. Okay, so we can't go crazy right now. You have to be smart. I may need to use Torg to do this. Torgify this a bit. Yep. As sad as that is, I may need to use my samurai to throw a grenade. <laughs> Days I wish I had my proper alien grenades. Okay. So we can't actually do anything there. Oh, it's not good. I need to blow my axe already? No, come on. Can't blow my axe already. Mutant's on fire. We can get one combat protocol kill for certain. Well, that guy's gonna die with the combat protocol jolt. We just have that other fellow. Is he still in cover? He's still in cover. Or is he? No, he is still in cover. So I need to... I probably need to do that jolt there. Because Spike's not going to be able to help me out anymore. I mean, he helped me out a lot by identifying the issue. Should be able to get Mad Dog up here just to flank this guy and kill him. That should be relatively simple. No! No, no, no! Oh, come on! That stupid-ass drone thing. Ah, oh, that stupid, stupid drone thing. I just, they haven't fixed that yet, and it really bugs me that they haven't fixed that yet. Ah, uh, okay, that's really not good. Spike, I mean, we're lucky. We're so lucky. Spike didn't get revealed right now. Jeebus. it's a dead muton, but we're gonna be very, very dead if we don't do something about this. I gotta get, I gotta get out of here quickly here so we can still have a chance at stepping up on that but god damn that freaking gremlin oh it's so frustrating at least I'm gonna have to I use an axe I think I'm gonna have to use an axe okay let's try to ping it 90%. Couldn't risk that muton running around. Okay. And then we're gonna go back up here to full cover. But our samurai is in deep trouble now. He's on fire, interestingly. He burned for five! Wow. Okay. That whole area is an inferno. Another ba Oh, yeah, no, sure. That's fine. Just bring everyone over. That's totally fair. Yeah, we're in deep, 
deep duty right now. 51%. Oh, I got lucky. We need to use a lot of explosives and probably some more lightning to handle this. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Got two. Interesting. Oh, and reinforcements. Jeez. Hey! You know when missions got hard? Yeah, this is one of them. Okay, wow. I can loot stuff with the gremlin. Let's end my turn. <laughs> but probably 80%. I might want to get the loot out of this at some point, but oh my god. Alright. We do what we need to here, because we need to eliminate numbers. We have eight active, and that can't stand. Alright, let's go ahead and try to drop these at least. Nice work, nice work. Oh, good lord. We did way more than I thought. Well, that took down five. That lightning spell. God, get my other necromancers on that train, please. I think my samurai is going to run and deal with this reinforcement package to get right in their face. Oh, no, this, they're really far over the bridge. I can't even do that. Well, that's good. We... Solved a lot of our issues. We only have these three active. Sweet. Can't grapple. We fired anything. 29 and 0. 0. Why 0? Oh, because you hunkered. Right. Oh, this is not stellar right now. Top notch. What can you do for me? Just not quite right. Not liking the Sam I am. Can we one shot the Codex? We might be able to. Alright, I gotta think about how to deal with reinforcements. That lightning was clutch, and I'll see how to handle the rest of this next time. But for now, as always, I've been Urse. This has been another mess of an episode in XCOM 2, The Hangover, and I will see you all next time. Till then.